now let's talk about flat brim um, uh, dreamboat. So this is a blend of Syrah and Cab Sauv, and it is heavy and deep, but not as heavy and deep as Syrah and Cab Sauv can be. <laughs> so um, this is, what did they say about this? They did not, they picked early, which meant that the acidity level was a bit higher than it. They um, did not do much throughout the process, obviously, I'm not sure why. Um, and they aged it in neutral oak. So it's not having any of like the traditional oak that you would think of with like a, I guess this is Oregon cabs off, but still like from the region. Um, however, on the nose, it is deep and by I would say American standards, pretty rustic. Um, it's got like tobacco, it's got leather, it even has like stone. Um, which I don't normally get in these regions. I can't tell you what type because I'm not a stone person. Um, those are the main, oh, and then obviously it has like black fruit, so blackberries. Pretty brambly. I don't remember if I already said smoky, but definitely has some smokiness in there. I'm not getting much of like a peppered note on the nose, but I'm sure that's going to come through on the palate. This is such a perfect winter wine. This wine to me tastes like winter, put me with a stew. I've got this leather tan in action going on. It's nice because it's not so tannic that it's like, holy crap, I need some like very specific fatty food to go with it. It can, it could play well with a lot of different things. I would not put it, it's not like hefty enough to do like slab in a cab style. Don't put it like a primo steak with it, um, but do put, ribs with it. Ooh, ribs. That's, that's the perfect pairing for this, actually. Um, or like a beef stew. That would also be really great with it. This is just like, this is February wine to the max. Like I'm at home in front of a fireplace. Honestly, actually at home in front of a fireplace. Man, I'm hungry now. With a cheese board with charcuterie and this. That is like perfect winter scene. It may be a guitar because it has, if you play the guitar in front of the fire, that's like, if someone has that and does that and takes a picture and sends it to me, I will be the happiest person and repost it to our Instagram immediately because that is literally what this wine deserves. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoy it.